Hello, I'm Bernard Hickey and welcome to 90 at 9 on interest.co.nz. Everything you need to start the day in 90 seconds at 9 o'clock. Starting now with news that ANZ National Bank plans to move up to 5% of its back office processing work to India by the end of next year. Now FinSec, the union, says this means up to 500 jobs will be lost. ANZ National denies this, says it will redeploy all of its staff and has no plans for layoffs given that it takes on about 800 staff a year in Auckland and Wellington. Meanwhile, overseas Merrill Lynch reports, has reported $6.5 billion more of subprime losses and says it will lay off 2,900 people. Citigroup is also warning it wants to cut costs by 20%, and it means it will lay off 25,000 people. Overnight also, the oil price hit a fresh record of $115 a barrel, but what's really interesting is that the price of rice hit $1,000 US a ton overnight. Now that's up 50% in less than a month. That's the internationally traded price. Vietnam, India, Egypt, China and Cambodia have all put restrictions on exports of rice. And now there's panic in the international markets. It's also causing riots in Bangladesh, Haiti and the Ivory Coast. Inflation is just not going away. I'm Bernard Hickey for interest.co.nz. That was 90 at 9.